farm, how does it then come here and get turned into a mattress? So we, we, we sheared the sheep, we take the wool from the farms, it goes to the washers, essentially, which we call scouring. We shampoo it twice to make sure it's extra, extra clean. And then it goes through to a cutting process and a blending process to make sure all the fibres are the right length and type. And then it, they pull the fibres apart and then re-layer them again in a lovely, fluffy, cloud-like pad. That's what we receive here at Hypnos. So when the pads arrive here, then what happens? We take them off the lorries and then they're delivered to a bay location. That's really important because the process with Red Tractor is that we have to manage the traceability aspect. Once it's in its bay location, the guys in the factory can pick from that location. And then we marry that wall with other fillings or sometimes we just put wool in the bed and nothing else. So typically we're putting a, a spring unit in which is designed for a specific need. Then we layer it with other fillings and then we cover it with all the fabric. So we put the fabric at the bottom, the fabric at the top, and then place a border all the way around and we sandwich all of those fillings in together. Then we sew it all up and then we button it together with the tufts. So that's the process really. So it's like making a big cake.